area of a triangle. So let's make this program. Uh, you go to program, PRGM, go over to new. We're going to create a new called area try because we only have three letters that we can type. T R, or eight letters, I mean. Um, and now I need to tell the user what I'm going to ask for. So I'm going to display, I'm going to do alpha lock and base is. Uh, now I need to ask them to input the base. So I'm going to prompt and we're going to give that the variable B. Now I'm going to ask for or tell the user I want them to put the height. So we're going to say height is Um, and now I'm going to ask the user to put that in. So I'm going to prompt for the height. And now it's time to do the math. So the area of a triangle is one half base times height. I'm going to store that to the letter A for area. And now I need to tell the user what I'm going to information I'm going to give them. So I'm going to go to display. And I want to say area of that's cute of a G L E area of triangle is and then I'm going to display oop I do that again. I'm going to <laughs> I got lost. Okay, I'm going to display program display A. And now my program is done. So I'm going to quit and let's try it. So to run it, I go to PRGM. I go down to area of try and I'm going to hit enter. I hit enter again to run it and it's going to ask me for the base. So let's say 10. Um, let's say the height is 5. So the area is 25 because area is 1 half times the base, which would be 5. And then 5 times 5 is 25. So that is the correct formula. And um, hopefully I'll see you for the next programming video.